Google DeepMind: 10 Things You Didn't Know About Self-Learning AI. By now, you have probably heard about Google DeepMind. This artificial intelligence technology has sprung up much controversy about how safe it is to unleash self-learning AI without the ability to fully control it. While the Elon Musks and Stephen Hawking's of the world are thinking more Terminator and iRobot sorts of outcomes, many other experts see this technology as a way for growth that we might not achieve on our own. Let's take a look at 10 things you probably didn't know about self-learning AI and why it might be the wave of the future. Number 1. Our brains provided the map. Google DeepMind is considered a self-learning form of AI. This means that rather than just looking through a menu of options and choosing the best one, this type of AI actually learns. What's even more fascinating is that the model of learning used to create DeepMind looks very similar to how the human mind functions. This means that DeepMind has the potential to think in a human way. Number two, DeepMind is smarter than us. One of the biggest AI challenges is when we pit man against machine. In Jeopardy fashion, IBM Watson versus Ken Jennings and Brad Rutter, Google decided to challenge man in a rousing game of Go. In a groundbreaking match in 2016, Google DeepMind's AI AlphaGo beat an 18-time world champion in the ancient Chinese game. Go is considered the most complex board game in the world, significantly more complex than chess. AlphaGo used a learning process to overcome Lee Sedol, who is considered one of the brightest minds in the world. Number 3. DeepMind is not your traditional AI. In the past, artificial intelligence was created to complete a specific task. IBM's Watson, Apple's Siri, and Amazon's Alexa are all forms of AI that work within a predetermined scope. They have a menu of potential outcomes, and when presented with a challenge, they simply choose the best outcome. DeepMind works differently. Based on reinforcement learning, this AI mimics the neural networks that our human brains create as we have new experiences and learn. This is very different than AI of yesteryear. Number four, DeepMind is still in its infancy. When you hear about DeepMind in the media, it sounds as if the technology has been in the works for years. In fact, DeepMind is a seven-year-old with a long way to go. The technology was co-founded by Demis Hassabis, Mustafa Suleiman, and Shane Legg in London in 2010. Google bought the company in 2014, and the groundbreaking AlphaGo win was in 2016. At just seven years old, DeepMind is still a baby by most business standards. Number five, DeepMind has very few limits. What concerns many people about self-learning AI is how limitless it might be. While previous iterations of AI had a scope that kept it in check, DeepMind does not. This general purpose AI can delve into just about any area where learning can occur. Number six, what does DeepMind have in common with Pavlov's dog and the Skinner box? Learning. If you have ever taken a course in psychology or learning, you have heard of things like classical or operant conditioning. These are concepts that outline how the human brain uses reinforcement to learn something new. Our brains have an innate way of making associations that help us learn. DeepMind is using this principle as the basis of AI learning. It actually mimics the short-term memory processes used by the human brain to learn novel concepts. Number seven, deep mind and breakthroughs. Even the biggest critics of self-learning AI cannot discount the potential for breakthroughs in medicine, healthcare, science, and many other areas. Can you imagine if we turned deep mind loose on cancer research? What if the robots are the ones who can make the breakthroughs that have eluded humans for centuries? DeepMind might be the answer for cracking some of the biggest unanswered codes in human history. Number eight, AI is its own new science. As AI has become a steadily increasing part of our world, it is emerging as its own science. 
There are now courses, careers, and literature dedicated solely to AI technology. Move over chemistry, biology, and astronomy. Make room for artificial intelligence. Number nine, DeepMind, our go-to problem solver. As humans, we have obvious limits. There are problems, issues, and obstacles that have eluded us for hundreds of years. War, politics, and financial crisis, these things remain despite help from the brightest minds in the world. Self-learning AI is showing serious potential at helping humans solve problems that we have been unable to resolve even with our best attempts. Number 10, new science equals new jobs. Because AI is emerging as its own form of study, it will also lead to many new jobs. While there is talk of AI eliminating jobs, this technology will also create many new jobs as it expands. Each year, the need for new computer experts who will work on the software that underlies artificial intelligence will grow. While artificial intelligence is still a great unknown to many of us, Google's DeepMind is giving us amazing insight into the possible future. Whether it scares us or not, AI is a reality. For those who want nothing more than to be at the cutting edge of science and technology, this new science might be the place for you. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment and subscribe.